everyone welcome back to my channel this is Donnie and today I have an unboxing for you a sneak peek from Diamond Art Club and as you can see here it's going to be a square drill a big square on the box and this one is called Royal Highness the artist is Gary Patterson. Here is an image of what it looks like. All right, so this one is 56 by 66 centimeters. It has 51 colors with 5 AB. I cannot wait to see where these ABs are going to go, and I'll show you. It uh, has 57,000. 681 drills. Yeah, that's a lot, but I'm sure it's going to be worth it. Can't wait to see it. It's so cute. I didn't pick this one out, but the person who sends me the sneak peeks has been working with me for three years now, and she knows my style, so she, <laughs> she says it's a surprise. And when I saw it announced in the Facebook, um, on the Facebook page, I was like, oh my gosh, it's a cat. And yeah, that is so perfect because, you know, cats can be such divas. And we just recently uh, adopted two sibling kittens, um, a boy and a girl. And one is, they, they, I mean, their personalities are so different. You know, it's just amazing watching them grow from babies to where they are now. They're four months old now, and I've shown, they've actually snuck into my videos. One of them has. Uh, you've seen them. If you've been watching my videos, you will have seen them in the, um, and so let me sneak in once in a while. Forgot that there's something in here to get out. Oh, and there's the toolkit down there. All right, let me show you that toolkit first. So on the package, it'll tell you that it's a square toolkit when you get a square diamond painting. And it will say round if it's a round one. And the only difference is the square toolkits come with this pointy pair of tweezers. I'll show those real quick. Uh, here is the, the drill pin that it comes with. And it comes with this pair of tweezers. Uh, and they have this super sharp point on them for picking up squares. Uh, there are rounded tipped um, <laughs> tweezers that are good for picking up rounds. I do carry those in my shop. A link is below as well as some other helpful links for you. They give you a bunch of baggies. Lots of baggies. They give you two pads of this heart-shaped wax in red. And if you want to buy more, you can get them in my shop as well. And I have little uh, heart-shaped containers that you can you can put these in, and uh, you know, of course, it's going to be a tight squeeze in those containers. I just had somebody um, contact me because she said the heart-shaped wax didn't fit, but you know, your heart-shaped wax isn't going to be perfectly heart-shaped, you know, all the time, like this one. You know, it it came a bit squished. So of course it's not going to fit in perfectly. You just squish it in there and you can fit up to two of them in there, but you have to take off the plastic coverings and you will still have no problem dipping into your wax, you know, with your tip because uh, as you can see, it's not going to hurt it to go all the way through the wax to the bottom. It's, it's just going to pick up what you need to pick up. And it's, you know, basically so you can keep track of your wax and so that it doesn't dry out from just sitting there open. 
but <clears throat> it's a cute little container and a lot of people love them not too many people have an issue but um, one in a million so here is the tray the craft tray the clear uh, boat tray some people call them boats and this is the pen grip the uh, comfort grip they call it and it, you know a lot of people know them as squishies and then you get a full um, <clears throat> a thin four placer which there are placers from three all the way to 15 and I do carry all sizes in my shop as well okay the next thing I'm going to show you that comes in the kit is this convenient handy dandy journal sticker and as you can see it gives you the information the name of it the artist the uh, shape the sh drill shape and the size of the canvas and of course the image and here is my book here and you just peel it off and I put it right there it makes it so easy for me to find which diamond painting, even though it's written down here. It makes it easier to have a visual image. And, you know, I have several different, you know, I, I love them. I love having the stickers and more and more companies are doing that now. So um, thank you for including stickers, journal stickers to go in your kits. Diamond Art Club. All right. Now, the canvas. Uh, this is made out of a material called tarpaulin. It is a soft material that is not just there for the fact that it's soft and something you can pet. It's actually got a purpose. It makes it so that your canvas is self-flattening and it retains the colors for a long time. Um, that way, you know, especially with round drills, you're, you're always going to have gapping between drills, square or round. And the color on the back of the canvas is what you will show through. And if you've ever done a blank canvas and done your own diamond painting, you will know the difference. You will see the difference on what it looks like when it's finished on having a white background with no color and one that has color. You're going to want that color. So that is why the tarpaulin is so wonderful. Uh, you also get this step-by-step uh, -step instructions. It has a thank you code inside. It actually also has some tips and tricks and it has your instructions on how to diamond paint and like I said, a thank you code. Now, I don't know the price of this diamond painting yet because it's not gonna be released until Saturday, the um, 18th of September. And, but you don't have to pay full price because if you've never ordered from Diamond Art Club, you can use my link down below to save 15% off your first purchase. After that, once you receive a diamond painting from Diamond Art Club, you can always get at least a 10% off code by looking at your canvas because at the bottom of the canvas is a 10% code. There's also a code, like I said, inside of this pamphlet and also in your packing slip that comes in the shipping box, there's another code there and it's a 15% off code. So, don't ever pay full price. You can always get a discount one way or the other, whether it's your first time purchasing through my referral link down below or through the three different places that I know of that you can get your code from your shipment. Okay, the next very convenient and very useful thing that comes with your kit is this sticker page. It has the same information that the little one had, but it also has a spot for your start and end date. And if you know of a way to organize these or keep these, I saw somebody, I saw a video once and I cannot for the life of me find where it is, um, where she made a little binder um, or she had a binder and I don't know where she got it and she punched the holes in these and she organized, she has a book of these. And I really want that. I just, I, my brain does not have the capacity to figure it out on my own. So I kind of wanted to go back and look at it again and follow the links that maybe she had or the suggestions she had. So if you guys know, please tell me. Leave um, a, 
tell me down below or send me a message on Facebook to Diamond Painting by Donnie or, you know, Instagram, you can leave me a message there or you can email me at diamondpaintingbydonnie at gmail.com. You know, there's many ways to get in touch with me. Uh, let me know. Um, you can't post links down below, but if you have an idea of where to find that video or if you've seen it, please tell me down below. Um, I appreciate it so much because I like to get new ideas and I like to, you know, show them, move them on and pay it forward and show other people that idea as well. Because that's one of my reasons for doing this channel was to help people out. Anyway, let's get back to this. All right. It is a, basically it's an inventory sheet because, you know, I never have issues with wondering if all my drills are there because there's a lifetime guarantee and a uh, missing drill replacement. Um, so if there's ever anything missing from my drills, all I have to do is contact Diamond Art Club and they send it out right away. I was doing a kit once and the bag for the color was there, but it was empty. Like it got missed or something and they sent it to me. I never had a concern or worry that I won't get my missing drills or if I spilled, they've replaced it. it. And it's just a wonderful feature. So I don't do inventory. I will look through the colors for you guys, but if it's something I'm not gonna show, I don't even open the drills. Um, I'm not worried about them missing anything. Uh, but this is a list of all your colors and these are individual stickers so that you can, you can peel them off and put them on your containers that you're going to store them up into. And yeah, it's super convenient. And sometimes I have to use an extra one and they have blank ones here for when I have overflow from, I need more than one container. So I'll just write that number on one of these blank ones and put it on one of the other containers that I've got my overflow on. And here is what it looks like close up. So there's all of our symbols. And I do like that they've, it looks like they've started using more letters and numbers and trying to use up all those before moving on to symbols because you see a lot of numbers and letters here before you see symbols. I mean, there's not very many symbols per se. It's mostly letters and numbers, which I really like that. And what I really, um, Oh, another thing is with Diamond Art Club, <clears throat> you know which ones are going to be the, the AB colors because they're always numbered below 150. So these first five numbers are going to be our, our AB colors. So 124, 129, 132, 137, and 141. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 on the canvas. One is going to be pink, two is going to be yellow, three is going to be orange, four blue, and five is white. So Let's look at the canvas now. So these are never small enough for me to just show on my desktop. And it doesn't matter how far out I zoom. Um, it's just really hard to see the whole thing. So I will take a picture of it and insert it here for what it looks like as it's completely in its entirety. <clears throat> All right, so wow, this 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 uh, adhesive cover is on here really nicely. I love that smooth feel. Um, so we've got here at the bottom is social media information and that code that you can use for a discount on a future purchase. Over here, <clears throat> it's got your pasting area. It's got the name of the canvas, the size, and the artist and who it's license to and then over here it gives you your your lifetime warranty information so all your canvases will have that on there and you have a key right here on the bottom right hand side and you'll have another one up at the top left and this is the bottom obviously so straight away I can see it's extremely color it's a, a color blocking sort of diamond painting which as you may know, it is my favorite because I love to use my multi-placers. So the background, it's got um, two different colors, two different greenish blue colors. And 
starting right here. You can even use multi-placers on this lamp. Or no, it's not a lamp, it's a stand of some sort. But we can see number five in there. So the white is, there's a little bit of AB white's gonna be in that. Also up in this one here, same with, um, nope, not this side. This side doesn't have it. There's one on that little knob right there, but there's no more going down. <clears throat> I've got this frog that do, will not go away. All right, so down here we do have number twos. So the yellow, we have yellows down in this bottom pillow. There's a bunch of them that go all through here and down there. And let's see, what else? Do we have any more ABs in this pillow? This is going to be a lot easier because it's in sections. Nope. But there's no more. Just the number two. Um, there's some fives, which is the white, in the eyes of these big-lipped fishes. Fishies? Fishies? And... And here, number three, the yellow, we're going to have these tulips, or if that's, I think they look like tulips to me. Uh, those are all going to be ABs, the, that yellow in all these spots. AB, ABs, ABs. If you don't know what AB is, don't worry, I'll show you when we get to the drills. And I can't wait to see that kitty. <laughs> uh, this section does have a lot of the the blues all these fours all these are fours look at that oh my gosh there's a lot of ab in this pillow oh my gosh beautiful that's gonna be so nice and then we've got the heart pillow here and it's got the ones so the pink I haven't seen a pillow yet that doesn't have at least a couple of ABs so each one of these pillows is gonna have ABs in it uh, we've got yeah pink this color through the lighter pink so the area with the lighter color is gonna be AB drills and there's a little bit of fives over here in the corner and this green pillow uh, yeah fives these stitch marks are fives and it looks like that's it for that pillow and now we're at the top of the little trays there's some twos so there's a yellow and a sure because there's number two and number three kind of look alike Three is darker. It's more of an orange color, I guess. So that was the color of the tulips. So it's going to be like an orangish yellow color. And this up here on this knob, those are twos, which is the lighter yellow. And then we have fives. Let's see, right here, these are fives, that white. And let's see, anything else in the cat yet? I don't see any more ABs for that. And let's see, going across on this pillow, it's purple, but we don't have any purple ABs. So if you have some, um, like square purple ABs, you could probably substitute some in here just so you can have them in all the pillows. <laughs> um, but over here on this side, we have a couple of the twos, which is the light yellow, uh, right in here, there, there. And then we have five, the hairbrush, all that white is gonna be AB. The five here, and then there's fives in the mirror. And those are gonna be all AB. And looking at this beautiful kitty, uh, it's a brown cat so I saw somebody asking about replacing the drills on it to make it a different color cat like black and white or something I am not good at things like that but you could always just you know take and write down the symbols that you see all the symbols that are going to be in this cat and you're going to want to well I don't even know if you want to do that you could just always 
just change the color, put, make it black and white. You know, maybe you could do this section black and this section white and do maybe some grays that go in the color in between and then kind of mix those colors in on the tail. I don't know, but you know, make the face look like your cat, whatever you want to do. It's your, your, your diamond painting. You can change the colors all you want. If you don't want to use their drills, you know, I don't know. You know, I would. I love using their drills because they're really good quality. Um, but you know, you could always change things out. You know, if you want to sparkle it up and use Swarovskis, that's your priority. It, you know, prerogative, and you can do that if you want. It's just going to cost you a lot of money, but do it however you want. Uh, these fives, there's fives here in the crown, so those are going to be AB, and. They're white, white ABs, sorry. And I think that is it for the ABs. Just doing a second glance here. But I look forward to doing something, you know, I love to do diamond paintings that have a lot of color blocking. I found I can do it so quick. You know, when I did uh, the New York skyline and it, it did not take me very long at all. So... I'm going to really enjoy this. I mean, all the lettering up here is color block because it's all the yellow number letters are all one color. And then the outline is another color. But like I said, the background is just two colors. It's not mixed with a bunch of different colors. It's two different colors. And so your only area that you're really going to have confetti is in the cat fur because it switches around a lot. Everywhere else, you're going to have good color blocking so it's a mix but it's mostly blocking as you can see and it's so cute i don't think i have any from gary patterson i don't remember I actually i might have one and it's another cat i don't remember i hate to say that um it's a specific artist when it was somebody else but i do have a picture so i'm gonna yeah Actually, it was a different artist. Sorry. So I don't, this is my first one from this artist. And yeah, I look forward to doing it. It is, it's just up my alley. It is so right for me. So that's the, the canvas. Let's look at the drills. Get this put away. Kitty, kitty. And my kitties are sleeping right now, so that's why they're not bothering me. Tesla's at school. And Jim is putting stuff in storage because we will be out of this house soon. But don't worry, I'm going to work on still having videos up for you while I'm on hiatus. All right, big, big bag of drills. Okay, I've got them all opened up here, and let's zoom in so we can see up close. There we go. What we see, what we got here. All right, our first strip is a really tiny one. But here are those colors. We've actually got one of the bags of AB drills. See how they sparkle more than these because these have a coating on them it's kind of a rainbow it's a rainbowish type coating that yeah oh, there we go it changes it shifts when you look at it different directions so it gives your diamond painting a zap of sparkle and they call it a b because it resembles the northern lights aurora borealis so those are so pretty. Look at that. All right. So that's number uh, four, the blue. <clears throat> and here we have our next strip. All right. My microphone is getting caught in my arm. <laughs> and 
Here's the little bits of colors. And let's see, try to find that next AB color. It's green. Um, haven't gotten to it yet. Up oh, there it is, there's pink. There's the 124. Yeah, so that's in that one pillow towards the top. And you can see all those reflectors on there. Beautiful drills. Yeah. And there's the white. There's the white right there. The white is what the one you can see the most clearly, the coating on it, because it's a big contrast. Oh, there we go, way up close. You can really see that coating right there. And then next to that is the orange that goes on those flowers. Let's see if we can look at the back a little better. Yeah, look at that. All right, so there we have two. Ah. There's two of our strips now. Let's go to the third one. And then this is the, we're getting a little bigger each time. Okay, here is our yellow, number 129. Are you maybe? I don't think I've ever, I think five is the most I've seen in a kit um, from Diamond Art Club. They started adding uh, more colors of ABs in one kit. And I love it. I love, love the different ABs that they're throwing in. All right, so here's the rest of the colors. I think that was our last AB. But, of course, we still have some beautiful colors. This has got every color in the rainbow in this diamond painting. Let me just hold it up a little better for you. Get it out of the glare. Oh, yeah, a pretty pink underneath. Pretty purples. Oh, my gosh, even the yellows are gorgeous. And there is the infamous 666. I love that red. And there's that beautiful pink. It's like a magenta color. And more greens, really, really bright, beautiful greens. And oh my gosh, look at that blue. I say that I think every time I see, and look at the sparkle. Every time I see this blue, I act like I've never seen it before. But look at that. Look at the beautiful sparkle. And these aren't even ABs. I don't think I've noticed how beautiful, how much they sparkle. Um, I can't remember if they changed suppliers or what. Or, I don't know, but those are just gorgeous. Oh my gosh, that sparkle is just to die for. All right, let's get that last strip, which has all of our large bags. I mean, the bags that are the fullest. And we're going to have a lot of duplicates in it, I'm sure, because of that background. Oh my gosh, it's longer than I thought it was. Ugh, okay. Oh, wow, that's a big bag of pink. And it's so heavy, it's falling off my table. All right, uh, starting with this brown right here. This is brown black, and there's two bags of that, 3371. And let's see, 743 has two bags. And this is 
3811. And we've got so far two. And, and there's a third bag right there. Uh, 775. I'm guessing, yes, this is that the majority of the background color. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten bags. Ten. At least it's not black, it's blue, which is a big change in, you know, a background color or something where there's a lot of, especially like in um, the stained glass images, you get a lot of black. And it's nice once in a while to have something that has a lot of blue or yellow. <laughs> and this one definitely has a lot of blue. So I'm going to stop crinkling now. So yeah. That is it for this diamond painting unboxing. Let me know if you plan to get this tomorrow. It's super adorable. And had I not been sent it, sent it sent to me for a sneak peek, I would be buying this one. I definitely would have gotten this one because it hits all the marks except one, which is I prefer round drills. But I'm actually getting used to doing the squares and getting quicker at it. I've been practicing. I say that every time, but I take big breaks from squares. And then my mind gets a little, uh, <laughs> I wouldn't want to say soft, but it gets kind of, it's because it takes more concentration to do squares. But um, when I don't do squares for a long time, my, my, I just start getting into the rhythm of rounds. And then I have to get used to squares again, and it takes me a while and then I'll get back to doing it fast again and then I enjoy it again so I like whether they're round or square I don't look at the shape when I actually purchase them for myself I will purchase them round or square but if I have a choice to pick from I will pick round most of the time but yeah either one they all look beautiful and you know as always I can't wait to get started on this one so let me know what do you plan to get tomorrow or well today is Friday so they are technically released tomorrow but what do you plan to get in the um, new releases that come out tomorrow there are two others that I will be getting myself one is uh, a Micah Jelena and the other one I'm not sure who did it but it's a couple of dragons so I gotta get it let me know down below what you thought of this canvas and what you're going to get tomorrow. Even if you're not going to get anything, let me know you're not getting it. If you're on a no-buy, tell me you're on a no-buy. And I look forward to seeing your comments. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe and hit all those notifications if you haven't already. And share if you find somebody you think that would like this. And I will see you all in my next video. Have fun diamond painting. And don't forget to always sparkle wherever you go and whatever you do. Take care, everyone. Bye.